What's going on? Welcome to Asian Cosell. If you guys give me the HKO special help the king out, hit the like, subscribe, and comment. All right, so let's talk about Megan Rapino is coming under fire. Yeah, so she says, yep, uh, so God does not exist. So here we go. Let's read this article. Megan Rapino is coming under fire. And Yes, so let's read the article. Megan Rapinoe has caused uproar on social media, media after telling reports she doesn't believe in God. So throughout the two decades, the winger and, you know, LGBTQ actually has been a decisive figure. Rapinoe played in three World Cup tournaments with the United States WNT, including two wins in 15 and 19 that helped uh, the U.S. team win gold medals in the 12 Olympics. Yep, so there's Megan Rapino. Yep, and the soccer star played her final game with the WSL yesterday at San Diego Snapdragon Sale. However, she was injured six minutes into her match with her team, Seattle Lorraine, losing 2-1 to one to New Jersey-based Gotham FC. In the post-game conference, Rapino joked that the sp suspected Achilles injury proved that God isn't real. So I'm not a religious person, anything the 30-year-old said, but if there was a God like this, is proved that this isn't because this is effed up. So yeah, it's just effed up, you know, like six minutes, effed up my Achilles. After the interview shared on X social known as Twitter by users Colin Rugg, it quickly went viral receiving 2.4 million views. New woke soccer player Megan Rapinoe said, there's no God could possibly exist because he got hurt. She got hurt playing for soccer. The co-owner of Concert Country site Trending Politics Row, dubbing Rapinoe a clown. So Megan Rapinoe, precisely what you think is classic and loathsome comment Jason Rest. So new so woke soccer player Rapinoe says, there's no God could possibly exist because she got hurt while playing soccer in the last game of the career. Rapinoe got injured six in in minutes in a match in a post-game uh, conference. She said she didn't deserve to be here. So let's see. And this is a long one. Although Here's I'm, I'm going to get the Aaron Rodgers treatment, whatever that is. Um, <laughs> so I'm going to be calling him or whoever did his surgery because we need to speed this up. But, yeah, I thought about it a little bit. I mean, you know, I'm not a religious person or anything. And if there wasn't God, like, this is proof that there isn't. This is f***ed up. Um, so, yeah, it just, it's just f***ed up because, like, six minutes in, f***ing eat my Achilles. I mean, what the f***? And this is a... Yep, so there you go in that post-conference. Yep, there you go. So, spoken like a true narcissist, said Joe. While X9 wrote, some more are unlikable footballer. Are you very tiresome listening to this privileged person griping about something like this? That's normally God has humbled you, sweetheart, and it went right to your head. Claim, get on tap. So, yep, it's agreed, writing. I think that God does exist. He is punishing Megan for her sinful ways. However, others use this defendant rapper know when, uh, Masubu Isha Kamani, she is effing right. There's no proof of God. She has a right to believe whatever she wants, just like every religious person is tied to their beliefs. Agreed. The real truth is our experience influenced the way we see and perceive things like I wish her were and hope nobody speaks against her. So Newsweek reached out to Rapinoe for comment. In August, Rapinoe played her final World Cup match with the USA. However, her decision not to sing the national cause country amongst conservatives. So off the pitch, yep, she's well known for LGBTQ plus 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 and women's right activism. She is one of multiple USNT players to battle for equal play with men's soccer play, taking part in the successful lawsuit against the U.S. Soccer Federation in 19 and 21. Opinion vote criticized lesser attempts nationwide to Ban transgender children from sports. And in 22, awarded the Presidential Medal of Freedom for her work. God, goodness gracious. Come on. 
So there you go. Yep. So there you go about Megan Rapinoe. I don't know. Yep. And I think this is a way of God speaking to her injury. He exists for this reason, you know. But oh well. That six minutes uh, should tell you something, Megan. But I guess uh, you can live in your delusion. You could live in your world. That's fine. You're entitled to your opinion. But we're not going to remember you for your accomplishments. We're going to remember you for being woke. We're going to remember you from disrespecting the United States flag. We're going to remember you from wanting transgender males in the women's sports. That's what we're going to remember you by. But oh well. And I'm not the only one speaking. So majority of America, you know, and that's why a majority of America was cheering against the WUST, you know, the USWNT. See? So there you go. So Megan Rapinoe, she goes out with a, what? A bang? I don't know. But oh well. All right, everyone. If you actually love this content, help the king out, HKO Special. Hit the like, subscribe, and comment. Other than that, I will see you in my next video.